After emerging from a furnace in Melbourne five days earlier, the heat was still on St George Illawarra as they attempted to avoid going 0-2. Brisbane were in the same boat, but Jason Nightingale stoked the Dragons' fire in the first few minutes. That is, until Justin Hodges extinguished the threat. Can you believe that? The veteran centre's daring strip on Jamie Soward not only saved a try, but helped the Broncos bag one two minutes later. And then McCulloch to Hammond, and Hammond goes barging over. Did he get the ball down? I think he did. The Dragons completely dominated the next 25 minutes, but they simply couldn't buy a four-pointer. Trent Merrin missed out after Nathan Fien was picked up on the radar for interfering with his marker, Andrew McCulloch. Then captain Ben Cray came awfully close a couple of times with Fien again the villain on this occasion. Ben Cray is over. No, it's gone forward. Well, the Dragons have put the blowtorch to the belly of Brisbane but they, well, the flame has gone out okay, again. Sorry. However, the home side's perseverance finally paid a dividend on the half-hour mark. And now it's gone to Michael Wayman. Oh, they couldn't stop him. And eventually the Dragons are over for a try. It was turning out to be an eventful night for Fien, who was clobbered by Josh Maguire as he put Wayman over, earning the Brisbane front rower an unwanted entry into the referee's match report. He wasn't the only Bronco to commit a cardinal sin, though. He goes for the turbo. He's sprinting down the ground, chasing him at the moment and pulling him down as Hodges. What a great chase. Oh, oh, Hodges, oh. now he's overdone it. And it's ten in the bin for Hodges. The Brisbane boys were able to keep their line intact with 12 men, heading to half-time at 6-6. Hodges returned from the cooler and had an instant impact, albeit with a little bit of help from the opposition. Oh, Nightingale's made a mistake. There could be a try here. And it's Hoffman. Hoffman who claimed the try. Hodges hobbled off with a problem he is all too familiar with. But it was the hosts left hamstrung when Brisbane went ahead by more than a converted try. Despite getting through a huge amount of defence on the night, it was the brave Broncos who finished strongest. Back to Norman. Norman will score. Yes, he caps a wonderful game. Saints had enough ball and opportunities to win several games, yet fell to a 16-point defeat, with Brisbane getting their show on the road for 2013. David Rollins, NRL.com.